All right, guys, Splits here. I'm gonna show you guys how to play PS4 games on your PC or laptop. They both work exactly the same. So here's my PS4 screen, and then here's my PC. And you can use a controller doing this, so you can see they both are working the same. And let me actually press the PS button. So yeah, it is on the PS4, so it's actually really easy. And if I had a laptop, I could literally take it to like a different room and I could still play it, which would be pretty cool. So before I show you guys how to do it, make sure you guys leave a like and subscribe because I do videos like these all the time. So yeah, let's get right into it. Alright, so before I show you how to do this, you do need a PS4. Like you can't just turn your PC into a PS4 because it's all done by remote play. So I'll show you guys what to download. And this is what you need. So I'll put this link below. This is the official ps4 remote play app and then you guys can just download whichever one you have for windows or mac just i have windows so just press the windows one and then right here is the download so once you download that you'll have it on your desktop so mine's right here so just i'm gonna open it all right so once you see this pop up you want to go to your settings and then the first thing you want to do is sign in to your psn account so i'm gonna just do this all right, so I'm signed in now. So the next thing you want to do is the resolution. So depending on your internet speed, you guys can pick whichever one. But for me, I'm just going to put a 720p. And then the frame rate, I'm just going to put a standard. And then just press OK. And then once you do all that, just press Start. Now this part right here actually takes like forever. So it's a lot uh, faster and easier if you just register it manually. So I'm just going to do that. And then it's going to ask for a code. So I'll show you guys what to do on the PS4 to actually get the code. All right. So just go to your settings right here. And then you want to scroll down to you see remote play connection settings and then add device. This is going to be the code that you want to put in. So my code is going to be different from yours, but that's fine. So let me just put it in. All right. So now from here, you just want to press register. It's going to start connecting. All right. So yeah, I can see I'm on my PS4 using my PC. So yeah, I can see like when I did this, my PS4 controller actually got disconnected. The only way to like, use the controller is just use the charging cable and just plug it to your PC. So I'm actually going to plug it in right now and you guys are going to see that it's going to instantly work. So I just plugged it in and then you guys can see I am now moving my PS4 menu around and it works like flawlessly like I don't even see any lag with this. So I'm just going to test it out on Fortnite to see how it looks like. All right. So here's the setup. Yeah, I can see my controller is connected using the charging cable and then here's my PC and then here's my PS4 screen and I can make this full screen if I want to. So you can see if I move around, they're both working. I don't see like any lag whatsoever with this. And it's actually streaming like in good quality, so that's good. So so yeah, that's how you play PS4 games on your PC just by using the PS4 remote play. It's really cool. And yeah, make sure you guys subscribe, leave a like, and yeah.